King Charles denies Prince Andrew's attempt to get £32,000 Indian healer guru expensed on privy purse as reports suggest disgraced Duke of York is lining up another television interview despite Newsnight fiasco. King Charles has reportedly given a fresh snub to his brother Prince Andrew by refusing to pay for a £32,000 annual bill for an Indian healer guru. The rejected expense claim is yet another embarrassment for the prince, who is reportedly considering telling his side in a new exclusive interview. The Duke of York submitted the expense claim to the Privy Purse, the king's private income which is mostly from the Duchy of Lancaster and it is said that he thought it would be signed off without challenge. However the king has told his brother that he will have to pay for the guru's services out of his own pocket. Andrew, 63, has been a client of the Indian healer for a few years, sources told the Sun newspaper. He is reported to treat the prince with chanting, massages and holistic therapy in Andrew's Grace and Favour mansion. And it is believed that he lives at the £30 million Royal Lodge in Windsor Great Park for up to a month. Before her death in September, the expenses bill was footed by Charles's and Andrew's mother the late Queen. But the around £24 million annual income from the Duchy of Lancaster is now the king's alone. A source told the son that the treatment is very expensive and that while the late monarch was happy to indulge her son over the years the king is far less inclined to fund Andrew's extravagances especially considering the cost of living crisis. Continuing, the source said that struggling families would not be happy with such large sums of money being paid to provide holistic treatment non-working royal. They said that the king thought his brother was having a laugh when he saw Andrew's expense claim to the privy purse for the healer. It was reported that historically expense claims like these would be signed off, no questions asked, but in Charles's era this is changing. The duke was stripped of his royal roles by the queen last year after sex abuse claims made by Virginia Jufri. But he may now give another historic tell-all interview, sources told The Mirror in another effort to clear his name. A source close to Prince Andrew said, nothing is off the table. Andrew has been made to give up his job and now potentially his home. The source added that he feels there is little to lose and that the prince believes he has already paid an awfully high price. His ex-wife, Sarah, Duchess of York, has been on a whirlwind press tour across the U.S. for her new book, a most intriguing lady and referred to her former husband as poor Andrew last week. She has long lamented his demise and exile from public life and has previously stated that she will always stand by him. Andrew told friends last month that he will not be able to afford the upkeep at Royal Lodge in Windsor when Charles slashes his annual £249,000 grant is slashed from April. And he and ex-wife Sarah Ferguson, 63, could now face being evicted from the Royal Lodge. But Prince Harry and Meghan's Windsor home Frogmore Cottage, which they are set to be evicted from, has been offered to the Andrew. Liberal Democrat MP Norman Baker told The Sun that the bill was an outrageous use of what is effectively taxpayers' money. Buckingham Palace declined to comment when approached by The Sun.